what we have here today is my 916 Hamilton 12 size pocket watch I am now going to uh, assemble for your viewing pleasure so I uh, cleaned oiled it and some stuff I already put on because to do it on camera just pain in the neck and it takes too long so let's see what we're gonna do I'm gonna start uh, with this uh, winding setting stuff. Drop that in there. What the heck? Something just fell. Damn it. Well, I'll slip that in. Okay. So let's get the... Let's see if we can get the show on the road. We're going to put all the uh, the wheels and gears and whatnot back in. And, uh, okay. Uh, this one goes here then. And then this one. That's the regulator. This is the fourth wheel. For the second hand, that goes there. And, uh. I'll have to put the other ones on too then. I guess this would be the third wheel. How does this go together? I always forget. Maybe it goes like this. So it takes me so long to put some of these together because I forget how to put it together. And there's the center wheel. And where is the mainspring barrel? And that goes there. So I got my wheels in place, and now I'm going to put on some plates. I'm going to put on this plate first, the one for the regulator. Yeah, not, uh, too much junk in the way. Uh, come on, There's so much junk in the way. I got to put my arm. Uh, I think this goes here. And I'm trying to see if I got the... Uh... No, I didn't. Oh, well, here this is where you struggle because you have to get the... Uh... Oh, I think I got it now. Yeah, okay. So I got that plate on and now something's sticking to my arm. Uh, screws. Let's see. Ouch. Hit the damn table. And the other screw. Come on. Okay. Now I screw them in. Uh, let's try this screwdriver and do the stuff righty because it's it's easier oh crap see that the plate shifted up on me now I don't know if the wheels moved away yeah they moved damn it They seem to be good. I always forget that I gotta hold this in position while I screw it down. Because this stuff. Yeah, you want to make sure you got them in because if you s tighten it up and they're not in the holes, you may snap off the pivot. And, uh, it's crap. The wheel becomes total crap. You 
can't fix it. Okay, let's see, part two. Uh, next on the agenda, the bigger plate. Oh, I gotta put this thing in there, which I don't know what it does. But I'll put it back on. And here is the next plate. Now I, since I put that silly thing, but I don't know what it does. Oh, look at that. Now you gotta do the same thing. You gotta jiggle around. Oh wait, this thing's in the way. Oh, I think I got it. This one is... is not that bad. And then I double check to see if my uh by turning the wheel and they all I don't know if you can see that but they're all moving smoothly. So I got that in. And I put the screws one Crap. Two, and I gotta find that in the damn screw. Freaking screws. And I think that's the third one that's gonna fall if I don't. I gotta grab it by the head. Okay, now I screw those in. I'm gonna move this back. I'm gonna hold this down with the tweezers because I don't want it to shift and then come out of position. I gotta rotate this so I can get the screwdriver in there. Oh, it's not gonna shift now since I got one of them in. And the third one. Whoops. Come on, come on. Uh, number th third one. Okay, so like I said, you know, everything moves smoothly. Whoops. And, uh... Oh, I can put in the pallet fork. I'll do that now. Uh, this container's empty. Get it out of my way. And now we'll do the pallet fork. Let me rotate the watch. Okay, now the bridge for it. Well, I gotta make sure I'm in the viewfinder. Ah, did you see that? Son of a bitch! got tangled up in it. How the hell did that happen? Let me tell you, if it's going to screw up, it, for me it's going to screw up. 
there is no debate, discussion. It's gonna screw up. So I got that in. It moves freely. You can see, moves freely. And uh, where's the screws for those? One screw. Oh, I can barely, I can't even see that. Damn it. And because I couldn't see it, it dropped. The next screw. Oh, that's why, because it's kind of tight in there. And we'll screw those in. What am I? Let's see, hopefully this won't move and shake too much. Yeah, look at it. Still free, okay. Okay, so that's in there freely. So now I gotta take a uh, oil break because I'm gonna oil this thing up now before I finish it off. So I shall be back in a blink of an eye. So I uh, finished oiling it up and now I can continue assembling it. Because some stuff you can't oil when it's put together. So I'm gonna put this thing on got a square hole. I need my pen. Let's see. I come around here. I'm going to push. And now it's... Now it's in. And the screw. And this container is empty, get it out of my way. And, oops, hit the camera. Oh, crap. I'm gonna hold this down. case it shakes and shimmies and gets out of position. I gotta get a bigger screwdriver for that. Of course I have stuff on top of my screwdriver. It's a pain in the ass. Where's my pin? I'm gonna stick my pin in between the teeth so I can tighten up that screw. Yeah, it's tight enough. Okay, uh, now... I wonder if I can wind this thing up a little bit. I wonder if I can cheat and stick a screwdriver in this hole. But, uh, nah, I guess I can't do that. I guess I have to wait till it's all assembled. Oh, uh, balance. Now we do the balance. I'm going to turn it this way. Okay, so here's my balance. Uh, let me push the fork to one side. It is, okay. So I'm going to put my balance on so my uh, roller jewel is to the left. Like this. So oh, i got to slip it underneath. So now my roller jewel is in the correct position, let's say. I want to... How come it doesn't want to go? What's going on? Did it move? Usually, pallet fork moves. Yeah, see, it moved. The son of a bitch switched sides on me. Always does that. Son of a bitch. 
So I'll put it on this side then. I don't know why it does that. It pisses me off. Yeah, okay. Sticking to stuff. Balance it in there, put the balance cock on. See what I'm doing. Where is that? The hairspring stud. Okay, I see the hairspring stud. Now is the balance in good or is it crooked? Looks crooked. Looks like it's in. Let's put a screw in there and uh, see what happens. I gotta pick it up by the head. Come on. Screws are a pain in the ass. Oh. Get in there. Okay, so now I know it's going to shimmy and shake when I screw it in. Because that's what it likes to do. I'm going to hold this down. Yeah, see, it's still good. I'm learning. These bastard watches want to screw me over, but uh, I'm on to their tricks. I'm on to you, you freaking watch. Okay, now i got to put the hairspring stud in that thing. Where's my pin? Oh, let's see. Now I have to do it from... Well, okay, you gotta get it in the... Oh, it won't go in. Damn it. It's too tight. I think I made a mistake. Because the escape wheel is in the way. How can I do this? Can I lift it up and over? take the balance off because I gotta put the uh, I gotta put the hairspring stud on the other side damn it I'm sticking to stuff oh well live and learn give me a tiny screwdriver Let's see, maybe I can just, uh... No, because the freaking thing shifted again. Pallet fork shifted. I don't know why it always does that. It always shifts. That's the problem I have with that freaking bull of a watch. The damn pallet fork kept on shifting. Every time I moved the the balance into the right place, it shifted to the other side. It's a constant freaking battle. Okay, let's see. Turn this around. It's still in the viewfinder. Crap, should have clamped it. Probably shifted on me again. Now, where's the hairspring stud? Oh, it's too low. Where's the pen? 
Mm. Okay, now I, uh, I don't know if you saw that, I slipped it into position. Now I just gotta get the uh, the balance cock screwed in. And I'm sure that's not gonna go easy. Come on, because it wants to shimmy and shake when I screw that in and go out of position. Hopefully the uh, power fork is in the right position too. And this isn't right. It looks like it's right, but we'll see. Before I tighten it all the way, I got it. It's in position. Let me just tighten this up. Okay, now I gotta tighten up that uh, uh, the little screws that hold the hair spring stud in, in position. Excuse me. Camera's in the way, I can't. I can't see. Well, it seems to be tight. Oh, of course, I'll check it later on. Uh, what else do I gotta do? So I completed this side. I'm gonna turn this over. And there's that piece that wants to fall out. Okay, fell back in. So now I gotta put the. Uh, I'm gonna put some oil. I forgot to oil something. There's my oiler. Let me close this up. I'm gonna oil this for the cannon pinion. This container is empty. Get it out of my way. Cannon pinion time. Oh, drops. Okay, this is this one should go on easy. I'm gonna push it with the back. All right, let me get this sitting right. Yeah. Right? There you go. It is in. And then I can put the, uh, well, wait, I gotta unscrew the, the dial feet screws because uh, I screwed them in so I wouldn't lose them. Now I gotta unscrew them. Of course, it doesn't cooperate. That's one. Should have done this ahead of time. Two. And where is the third one? the third one. Oh crap, I took it out too much. Oh crap, that's what I was afraid of. That's 
Okay. Now I put the uh, our wheel. Maybe I should have put oil on that too. Ah, I'll do that later. And the little washer to keep everything together. And I think I put the dial on now. Dial, dial, dial. Of course, it doesn't want to go on easy. Oh. Son of a bitch. Oh, yeah. Fight. Let me screw this in. There you go. Damn it. Okay, screw it in. Tighten the screws. And number three. Okay. Now I'm going to case it. I can figure out which is the back and which is the front. I think this is the back. Oh, this is the front. So now I'm going to case the watch movement. out of my way. Uh, let's see if it cooperates. Oh, this is the bent case. Which I didn't straighten out because I think that's in all the way, I guess. Somehow I don't think it is. Looks like it's in all the way. Let's see if I can... Well, I'm going to tighten the case screws. Because if I wind it... I'm sure it's probably going to pop out. I'm going to rotate this because this is crazy. This one's tight because that bent case Pulling it snug. Okay, let's see if this thing works. Oh, took off. Maybe I should have put the hands on first. Man, this is going on long enough. Let's 
Jeez. I think I got it. No. I should get that. Oh, I think that's it. I'm not going to push it. Let me, uh... Let's see how it runs. That's running. Unless I forgot to, uh... Huh. I don't know what I forgot to do. Anyway. I'm going to put the hands on, then i got to uh, give this the once over off camera to see if I uh, forgot something, screwed something up, something's out of adjustment. Come on, I'm trying to get the hands on. Our hands. I'm going to put it at 12. That's a little off. Yeah, it's a little off. And a minute hand. Things don't want to be picked up. Yeah, I gotta adjust that. I'll do it later. Like I said, go back and fix any mistakes. And the second hand. Give a little push. This minute hand has to be, uh, whoops. I'll have to fine tune it. So basically, that's it. Assembled and running. So I don't like the way it runs, but I'll have to fine tune it. So I think that's enough of this nonsense. These putting together videos take a long time. Uh, I hope you enjoyed the show. Thank you for your cooperation and uh, have a good day.